Hey guys, Jacob with Jacob Comics. All right, we have a really fun episode. It's New Comic Book Day. Happy New Comic Book Day, July 20th, 2022. I hope you guys all found what books you were, you know, expecting to find in your cubby and uh, were able to pick up all the books. Now, I, I got, I didn't get too many books this week, but I got some really cool uh, back books from the back issue. And uh, yeah, before we get dived into the, the awesome books that I got this week, I want to uh, let you guys know really fast about our 400 subscriber giveaway. Um, so yeah, our 400 subscriber giveaway is the Symbiote Spider-Man number one, uh, Symbiote's uh, store exclusive variant cover with Venom there eating Spider-Man cereal. And yep, we've already hit 400 subscribers. But you still have a chance because we're not going to be doing the raffle until Saturday morning. Uh, to be like the 24th, I think. So yeah, you guys have a couple more days to like and comment on all the videos where I promoted the 400 subscriber giveaway. And that'll give you the best chance to win. And yeah, we'll be giving the book away on Saturday. <laughs> Alright guys, let's go ahead and get dived into the books that I got this week. I'm really excited to show you. Um, now let's start with the new issues here. So first up, uh, we got, if you watched yesterday's review, we got Nightwing 94 with this really cool cover. kind of want to hold this sideways so you can see. Uh, with Roland there, and he kind of looks like the cityscape. It's a really cool cover. Uh, cover by Bruno Redondo. And uh, yeah, the story has been really entertaining. And you know, no, no heavy spoilers here, but... Just to let you guys know a little bit about what's going on, maybe get you interested in the book. Uh, right now, Nightwing and Oracle are are actually uh, are actually starting to get together. They they actually uh, they kissed in that issue, and so things are happening. Yeah, if that's if that interests you, then yeah, check the book out. So you got you know you got Barbara Gordon and Dick Grayson are are uh, are boyfriend and girlfriend pretty much. <laughs> All right, guys. Uh, next up here we had a uh, Knights of X number four and this one's been super cool with lots of uh, really intricate artwork and colorful designs and and a fun uh, entertaining side X-Men story with you know our hero X-Men in this in this other realm and it's it's pretty much completely detached from the mainline X title as far as you know having to read the other books to know what's going on in that book um, though it does take place in current continuity, it's kind of like, uh, you know, obviously it's the uh, Excalibur, you know, but different this time. They're not just, you know, based here uh, in the regular world. They're actually in this kind of alternate reality where Merlin has, uh, is basically like the big bad guy and he's trying to kill all the mutants. So yeah, not to spoil, not spoiling it, but that's kind of the setup. If that sounds interesting, yeah, Knights of X. Uh, this has been a fun read. Um, and next up, you guys know I'm I'm doing uh, getting all the Miles Morales Spider Man because I I'm a big Spider Man fan. And so we had uh, Miles Morales Spider Man number forty here, and uh, this one's been pretty cool too. Uh, Miles is in like an alternate universe, and um, yeah. There's an alternate version of him that's evil, and his sister's grown up now, and she's called the Spider Smasher, and they, yep, they gotta fight him, and that looks like that's, uh, that's his uncle, the, uh, the Prowler, who's still alive in this alternate universe. <laughs> so it's, it's been pretty, it's been pretty good, like, it's, you know, it's Miles Morales' Spider-Man, so, and the artwork's always fantastic. Um, <clears throat> now let's go ahead and get... Let's get dived into uh, the books that they had uh, in the case. So not in the back issue section, but they had them in a case. And a lot of times when they get new collections in at my LCS, they, uh, they put some of the really nice books in the case. And so I saw these two. And uh, as you guys know, if you've been watching the channel for a very long time, this is actually the very first comic book I ever remember owning was not this specific book, right? But it was this, uh, it's X-Factor 24. I'm just being super careful because it's legitimately the crispiest copy I've seen of a book this old, like ever. <laughs> and I, 
Um, I have a submission coming up this weekend too. As you guys know, I, I send out 25 books every, every four weeks. So I have one coming up, so I'm gonna press this one, press and clean this one. And I really do hope that's a 9.8. It is the nicest copy of X Factor 24 I've seen. And it's, there's not a thing, right? It's, it's like you bought it off the, the shelf brand new. And they had another one. They had a really nice collection come in with a lot of extremely high grade books. And so I got this one as well. And uh, this one's actually one of my personal grails. And so to find it in this condition and, and uh, you know, I'm going to, I'm gonna press and clean and submit it to CGC myself and see what grade I get. Um, yeah, I think that's really that's really kind of cool. I, I, I believe it's high grade, uh, maybe 9698 looking at it uh, with what's not pressable. The same with the X Factor, but yeah, check this out guys. It is a New Mutants 87, the first appearance of Cable first printing and it's yeah I have it in a top loader I it's kind of an ex more you know it's an expensive book in in, in this higher grade um, so yep I was super stoked to find that for for the price that I got it at and uh, it's another book that kind of in, in in my eyes goes right along with the uh, the first gambit up there, you know, it's just, man, first, the first cable, uh, being a, being a, a, an eighties and nineties kid, those are a lot of times it's, it's those, those late bronze age grails that really, really kind of get me excited, but all right guys. So that's what I have today. I got, I, I didn't get too much. I got three books this week, uh, new books. Uh, but hey, I did find some really nice keys um, in high grade and we'll be submitting these and getting them back in about a month and a half and seeing what they are. So yeah, you know, <laughs> if all this sounds like fun to you and you want to keep uh, keep up with me, yeah, uh, subscribe to the channel. Uh, like and comment will also help the algorithm uh, so more people see me. And uh, yeah, by doing that, I'm, I'm going to give you guys a chance at winning the free book. So you can't you can't beat that. Someone wins a free book and uh, more people see because I, I think what I'm doing is really cool and fun. And uh, yeah, I mean, if you like comic books, check this out again one more time, guys, just to show you how how nice this copy of, uh, of the X-Force 24 is. And uh, if, oh, if you didn't know, I, I, maybe I mentioned it, maybe I didn't. It's the first appearance of uh, Archangel or Angel as Archangel. All right. All right, guys. So that's what I have today. Yeah. And, uh, you know, I'm usually on IG live doing live sales as well. So yeah, if you like the comic books that you see, Hey man, sometimes they're for sale. Come check me out. Um, also if you want to help support the channel in another way, you can click the link below shop on my eBay store and I'll send you some comic books. All right, guys, we'll see you tomorrow and have a great day.